Hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Sean. I'm broadcasting from uh, Jehovah, Malaysia. So uh, I have a question for you. So where's my uh, lion ball? Uh, if you can find it, my lion ball within uh, five seconds, uh, your IQ may be over 200. Uh, just kidding. Uh, I went to a shopping mall uh, called uh, KSL. Uh, it's my uh, it's uh, it's it's near the hotel that I'm staying at. Let me show you the picture. Uh, this is the KSL. I took this picture uh, in across from the street. Okay, I went there to 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 eat dinner uh, last night, and then also. Uh, I wanted to purchase some uh, uh, Android uh, a phone case, so uh, I went there. Let me, let me uh, show you this one. See, uh, there's a lot of uh, phone cases, right? Uh, smartphone uh, cases. Uh, so many of them here. And then here's my lion ball. This is the answer. <laughs> I think you find it easily, right? I think so. But in this uh, shopping mall, uh, many of the stores are selling goods on the stand, like uh, like this one. Let me show you another one. Like this. It's not in the in the room, but the outside the room, and then stands like shop stands, like this, like uh, you know street stands. So many of them. And then uh, you, if you if you find uh, something you know you want to purchase. Then uh, I got to negotiate, so they listened to me. <laughs> so I got to negotiate, uh, you know, the Android phone case. Actually, I don't have this now, but uh, maybe later I'll put it on. Okay. But so many uh, interesting uh, things in Jehovah, Malaysia. So uh, hopefully I can share more about my stay in Jehovah. Okay, let me close this. Okay, uh, enough of my story, <laughs> as usual. So uh, let's uh, uh, go to uh, Signal and then 303 slash D. Okay, uh, today I'm going to briefly uh, talk about Signal and then also the 303 slash D. Okay, uh, let's see. Okay. For this one, the signal. I'm not sure if you have already read our uh, email that we've been sending out uh, with this, uh, with the link uh, for this signal page. Well, uh, if you uh, if you have chance, then if you have time, please uh, check out the email from Hirose Financial UK. Then just open the link. Then it will take you to uh, this uh, signal page. Okay, let me explain this one. So if you, you know, if you do not know how to analyze the market movements, whether the market is moving up or down or flat, if you do not know how to analyze it, then uh, uh, this uh, signal will help you to understand. And then, you know, knowing the market movement is very important in your binary option trading especially when you want to make money <laughs> because uh, if you if you uh, if you if you see that the market is moving up then you can simply purchase high right then you end up in profits and if the market movement is going down and you simply purchase low then you get profits and if the market is going flat you know it doesn't tell you whether more uh, market is uh, moving next up or down then you better not purchase any options that way you can uh, save your money don't want don't want to waste your money right so okay now I'm looking at the signal page and I have here euro dollar uh, starting pound dollar dollar yen OG and so on okay so where is says strong buy meaning market is going up 
So strong by meaning it's stronger than the simple by, right? So there's a chance, higher chance that the market is moving up. And then when you, when it indicates strong buy and when you purchase high, then there's a high chance that you have profit at the end. So buy still okay. The market is uh, 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 moving up, but uh, less stronger than strong buy. Of course, okay. The same can be said for strong sell. So when the market is telling you, uh, sorry, when the signal is telling you strong sell, it means the market is moving down. Okay. So of course this one is also stronger than the sell, you know, simple sell. Okay. So. Okay. Now look at the time frame here. Uh, I hope you can see this here time frame. We have. 1 minute, 5 minutes, 15 minutes, 30 minutes, hourly, 5 hours, daily, and weekly. Okay? So, as always, when I use 303 strategy, D, I trade on uh, 3 minutes option. So, I believe 1 minute time frame is enough for me. Okay? So, Again, well, this signal is a combination of, uh, you know, indicators. So you do not have to spend time analyzing the market. You do not have to spend time setting up any technical analysis in your chart. You know, if you have like a MT4 platform or whatever, you don't have to do it. Basically, this signal does it for you. Okay. So many of our customers, you know, requesting a signal and, uh, I hope this one is the answer because this one is very simple. Don't need to set up. So, okay, now let's uh, move on to 303 slash D. Okay. Okay, let me refresh the signal first. Okay, Darayan saying strong sell. Okay. Let me choose, let me look at the Darayan. Let me open 30 minute option. Okay, good. And let me open another platform at the bottom. And then select Darayan. <coughs> okay, and three minutes. Okay, 303 strategy. Okay, so today I'm going to purchase when the three zero, my 303 strategy corresponds with this signal. Okay, so when the 303 uh, uh, strategy telling me, okay, now I need to purchase high, and when the signal is telling me strong buy, then go for it. I purchase high. But the, when the mark, uh, 303 strategy is telling me uh, the market is going down, then the signal is telling me strong sell, then I purchase low. Low. Okay. So, let's do it. So, 303 strategy. Okay. So, I have Darayan 30 minute option a graph at the top, and at the, at the bottom, I have the Ryan three minutes uh, option. Okay. Uh, let me close this one. Let me do this again. So, for you to add another graph, just simply click on Add Instrument and Darayen. and whatever I mean, whatever instrument. Then uh, click on uh, Darayen and you see three minutes here. Okay. Now, so looking at the 30 minute graph, okay, here this part, it looks like the market is going up. But here, this part, you can tell obviously that market is going down, right? So if I are to draw the trend line, this one is going up, 
down, up, down, up. So basically, you connect the ups, uh, highs of the market movement. So this one, this one, this one. So if I were to draw the trend line, it goes like this. Okay? Let me do this again. It goes like this. Okay. If I were to draw the trend line here, you will notice that the market here, this part, just broke through my trend line at this point, right? So when the market uh, price breaks through the trend line, there is a tendency that the market movement will change. So when it was going down, then it changed the direction and it goes up. But this one, it seems that the, the market is still going down, but now market price is going up. So it might be that the, it has changed the direction already. Okay? So I want to uh, I want to see this movement a little bit more before I decide high or low on uh, Darien. Okay. Now you see uh, you find out whether the market is going up or down or even flat. Then you decide high or low, or you don't purchase at all when the market price is flat. Okay. So if you decide high or low then you purchase in this three minute option okay that's how you do it that's why this is called 303 strategy okay so hold on a second okay um It could be that it's really changed the direction. And let me look at the signal. I like to refresh the page <laughs> always. Now it's showing strong sell. So it might be that trend line could be drawn like this and then market price will come back a little bit down and going up. See that? price is coming down a little bit right and now it's showing high so I wait a little bit longer Oh, now it's through uh, sell. Okay. <laughs> so it doesn't correspond, so I don't make trades now. Yeah, it's coming back, coming down. Now it's showing. Okay. Now it's showing strong buy and trend line here. Um, but here it seems to be flat, so maybe I wait for the next option. Let's 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 see this movement together. So market price is going up, but here is this point, this high and this high. So this point didn't uh, break through this point, right? So that's why I decided not to trade. See that the market price is going down a little bit. So if this point was higher than this point, then maybe I would have gone for it. But uh, uh, I decided not to purchase high. Yeah, so if I had purchased at this point high, then uh, maybe I lost this one. See that? Flat this point okay let me let me change the instrument euro dara wow 
wow this one is uh, this one might be also see that the this one seems to be going up here trend line could be drawn like this but here market price has uh, break through the trend line so now it could be going down now it's showing the you know the euro dollar showing still buy but it's not strong buy let me prepare three minutes so if we set strong sell I'll go for low oh it's going down a bit see that see that it's going down So I wait for the market price to come back a little bit higher, hopefully. Uh, still continue to, uh, but it's showing strong buy, so it might come back a little bit higher. Well, it takes a uh, it takes a uh, patience. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. It's coming up, coming back. Okay, maybe a little bit higher. Maybe a little bit higher. Now the trend line could be drawn like this. So this point around here, so a little bit higher than I purchased low. Well, it's just showing strong buy. So it doesn't fit my uh, strategy. So when the uh, 303 strategy D and signal correspond with each other the, the much then I purchase still showing strong buy So wait for a second. Okay. Uh, while I wait for the, uh, hold on. While I wait for the, uh, thank you, uh, Carlos, always uh, giving me like. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, Let's wait. Uh, why do I wait for the next option? Do I have a chance to do the question and answer? Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. So I purchased low. Euro dollar signal is so showing a strong sell and see that the trend line here it has reached this point so hoping that the market price will come down maybe zigzag like this I have 300 ready So if the market price goes against me and then maybe come back uh, around here, this point, then I go for low because uh, I know that the trend line is still low.
Okay, why don't we see this movement together? Okay, the, I think the market is getting a little bit flat. So when it's like this, I don't want to purchase another one low. It's okay to lose this one. See that? coming back see that around here but still so I don't know how it's going to end up I still have one minute so uh, I hope that the market will come down I want to see like this movement here <laughs> this movement see that So, well, it's, it is coming back, but uh, I don't have enough time, I guess. Oh, oh, it's okay. I lost this one, but. Uh, it doesn't mean that uh, I'm dead, you know, I'm still alive, so hopefully I can do better next one. But uh, anyway, uh, let me share uh, uh, this one question. Okay, uh, is, well, there's one customer is asking me, so in what circumstances I should not make any binary trades? Well, see that the market is coming down. See that? So if you look at the 30 minute charts, see that? It might come down a little bit further down. Anyway, okay. So in what circumstances I should not make any binary trades? Okay, this one is good, good, good question. Very good question. Well, it is important to learn when to trade as well as when not to trade very important so for example I've been talking about 303 strategy so you do not want to trade when the market movement is flat so when the market is moving flat so maybe this one here the chart here it seems to be flat right so when the market movements like this even now I guess you don't know where the market is going next. See that? Oh, coming back a little bit. Mm. So around this part, you do not want to make any binary trades. So when the market is obviously up or down, then that's when you want to trade, high or low. Okay? So hope that makes sense. See, the chart is going down. See that? Okay, so next question, I think I have some more time. Okay, next question, uh, I want to share this one. So, oh, thank you very much. So this customer, uh, he learned that the signal and 303 strategy works well. Thank you very much. And then he's asking, can I also use Martingale strategy? Yes, you can. <laughs> yes, you can. So if the market goes against you, right? So you can purchase more trades within the three minutes option. So for example, like one, three, and nine. So you triple the uh, trade amount when you purchase additionally. So let, let me let me try this. Okay. 
Okay, so Euro dollar. I hate Euro dollar because I lost, so I try another one. Just kidding. Okay. This one over. Oh, if you look at the 30 minutes graph, it looks like it is going down. So I wait for the signal. So three. Oh, oh, pop, 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 pop. Okay. Then purchase low. I purchased the lion low hundred dollar. Okay. Well, actually, this one is not the uh, uh, Martingale, but let me take. A, I hope I can take a screenshot. But anyway, so let's just suppose that uh, I purchased low at this point. One dollar, then market is going against me, right? Like this. So if the market goes against me, then you want to purchase another low, maybe around here, and that this time three dollar. Then if the market price goes even higher, then you want to buy nine dollar low here. Okay, one dollar low here, three dollar low here, and nine dollar low here. Okay, so what happens if that if you do that? Okay, for example, if you even lose the first one dollar trade, then if your second or third trade wins, then you end up in profit. That's how the Martingale strategy works. So when uh, you want to do a Martingale strategy when you are confident that market trend looking at the 30 minutes option market trend is either down or up okay so if you are confident that the market movement is in either down or up then you can purchase additionally so within three minutes you purchase low here then within three minutes it goes like this right so it's going down but then it goes against you then here you want to purchase the second one low one dollar and three dollar and then if you want to uh, sorry if the market price will goes even higher then you want to purchase another low here so one three nine low 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 so unfortunately you lose the first trade but second or third wins then you end up in profit for this three uh, three minute option that's how martingale works even the first two trades lose if your third trade wins then you end up in profits hope maybe i can do this uh, sem uh lesson or live trade show maybe uh, even uh, maybe next time or uh, you know the coming uh, uh, coming uh, trade shows because this one is very um, powerful so combination of signal 303 and martingale it's really powerful okay so I want that the uh, last trade so let's look at the trade history so dara yen 100 dara then I made 70 dara but I, uh, my initial trade was the minus uh, 100, so in total minus 30. But hopefully uh, you you get what I'm trying to do here. Okay. So if you have any questions or many you know unanswered questions or feedback or anything, uh, you can always uh, come to our uh, Facebook. You can leave uh, comments there. Then. Uh, Basically, uh, uh, not basically, but last weekend we reached 1,000 likes. Likes. So thank you very much. And uh, your feedback will improve our contents on the Facebook and also daily email that uh, we are sending out. And also it helps us uh, the customer support, especially when we call customer 
because uh, we we need to know uh, what your problem is so that uh, when we call we can solve your questions and problems together uh, our customer support is very friendly and then often uh, we use Skype when we call because uh, we want to cut down the cost so uh, uh, when you see the the numbers that are you know doesn't this uh, you know the very unique then <laughs> that's Skype okay that's that's us so please pick up the phone so we can uh, help you out okay and uh, yeah any feedback or anything on Facebook more than welcome all right so and then also we have a live chat service uh, of course we do email uh, info at hiroseuk.com and then uh, if you are brave, uh, brave enough uh, to call international phone call uh, office is based in London so you can make that call uh, not many of the customers make the international phone call so uh, I guess the uh, live chat service is better for you and uh, recently uh, we also launched the uh, whatsapp services and then uh, for the recent customers we sent out the our whatsapp number so please register so uh, uh, if you have any questions you can do the WhatsApp okay so I guess uh, that's one of the very uh, convenient way for you to contact us so please do that as well all right so uh, I guess uh, time is up already uh, time flies I hope you enjoy it so uh, let me let me hold on hold on <laughs> Carlos, thank you. Thank you for your comment. You say uh, you're welcome, my friend. Yeah? <laughs> thank you very much. Me too. <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> Sorry, uh, maybe I need to refresh my Facebook <laughs> every time I want to check. So uh, it's not uh, real time. But uh, thank you very much, Carlos. Okay. So uh, finally, I want to uh, talk about this $10 welcome bonus. So if you if you do not have a binary options account with us, uh, please come to our website and uh, open a binary option account. Once your account has been activated, uh, we give you a ten dollar welcome bonus. So with this ten dollar welcome bonus, you could do martingale, right? One three uh, not oh, so one three nine uh, addition. That's the uh, 13 yeah so it's not enough but you could do one and three yeah I guess that's enough but you can do the martingale and then uh, you know if you just want to try 303 strategy you could do that as well with this tendara welcome bonus so uh, tendara is all yours so there's no risk so uh, if you want to familiar familiarize yourself with our live platform tendara welcome bonus is the answer for you okay so hope you enjoy my show. So uh, I think uh, I'll see you tomorrow again. Eh? Okay. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.